by Dreams and today I am going to do a wardrobe revamp. But first make sure you hit that subscribe button, the like button, and that notification bell so you know when my videos are coming out. And if you're looking for like a look that is very chic, you're trying to elevate your game and change your wardrobe, um, there comes a point in your life where you're like looking at your closet and you're like this is not me anymore. Like if you're coming out of becoming a teenager to in your 20s and then if you're going from your 20s to your 30s or you're just not feeling it anymore i got the solution so i'm going to show you guys some timeless basics that you can start building up your wardrobe so that you can throw it on and still look really nice and cute at the same time so i'm just going to first tell you guys what i got on currently right now so i have on a bodysuit it's a black bodysuit that i got from naked wardrobe and it clips at the bottom but i also paired it with these boyfriend jeans and a classic heel so i just put on like this little heel this slide on heel that i got from fashion nova and i like it because it has the straps but I can go anywhere with this and still look well put together and look nice. And I also have gold jewelry. Now gold jewelry looks good with my skin tone. I always feel like gold jewelry always has like a richness to it and a girth to the look. And it ties everything together. But if you wear silver, that's okay. I feel like if you get a nice boyfriend jean and a basic top, then you're good and i always feel like the basic top colors that you should start building with your wardrobe is black white and a nude color sometimes you can go with like a minty green color as well and just having like basic tops some v-necks and everything and a good place to find a lot of those are from like zara from like h and m um, naked wardrobe and they have pieces that really fit well for every body type and these jeans that I got from um, H&M, this was in a size 4. And I just like the way that they fit. They're not like skinny jeans, but they have like a little, small little bootcut. It just fits really nice around the body. And you can get jeans without the um, holes right here, but I just thought that it added like a little bit of oomph to the outfit. And when I tell you that I wear black for everything, like I love black, but I try to switch it up and put like, you know, white, a white tee or, you know, something nude with it. And if you want to, you can kind of pair it with a belt. And so over here, I have some bags that you can also add to your outfit. And I just kind of wanted to show you guys some of the things I have that you can add to an outfit just to make it jump. I got this particular purse from, actually I got this purse from Forever 21. And it's a classic black um, purse. And I like the handle. It actually came with a strap to kind of go around your waist as well. Like to go across your body, across body. But I took the straps off and this is something nice too to wear. And I also have the gold metal on it here. So I like it because it's very basic it's very classy and i can fit things in here so if you're trying to get something that's like you know on a good budget but still look nice you can do that like i got this from forever 21 you don't have to do a high-end purse okay so this is what the bag looks like got it from forever 21 but it doesn't even have to be this bag it can be a nice bag of your choice you can go to home goods you can go to marshall's and you can find something that looks good with your outfit another thing that i would say to kind of upgrade your outfit is you can for instance i have this on right now but you can throw on a blazer and let me so, show you two blazers that you can start adding to your wardrobe and you don't have to do this you know you don't have to go out to the store and just like buy it all at once like what i'm trying to say is you can go to the store every time you get paid say you know what i'm gonna get two items to add to my wardrobe revamp you know um i'm at a point in my life where i just kind of want to change out the things that i have and have that more chicer look have those basic essentials that are timeless you know first i want to show you this leather well it's not leather it's like faux leather and i got this from fashion nova now i got this in a small they didn't have a medium i would have preferred a medium but they have a jacket like this that's um bottom and i would say that whatever size you get size up a little bit so like if you're small get a medium just to kind of have a little, a little oversized look but i like this too i wish it was just a teeny bit bigger but i wondered if it, if i did get a medium would it fit my arms because you know i'm petite i have short arms so i really like this look right here 
feel like this is a look that you would go get a cocktail with your girls or something because it kind of has like this upbeat look to it somewhere that you're just kind of going out and chilling but still looking cute and you see how i turned this little outfit from a day to night outfit so you want pieces that are timeless that you compare with different things and it doesn't look like that you're wearing the same things over and over again like you want pieces that you can go from day to night that you can switch out from jeans to a top like tomorrow i could wear these jeans but wear a different top and no one will even know that it's kind of the same outfit you know it's really elevating your wardrobe and I wanted to show you guys another bag that you could wear or that you could put with your outfit that's kind of like a basic but something that will bring your outfit together. So I've got this little bag. It's a replica to um, like Louis Vuitton clear bags that they have but usually of course it has the Louis Vuitton logo or it has like a little wrap on it. But I really thought that this was super cute. I got this from um, Fashion Nova and it's like a little clutch. And you can put like your lip glosses in here, you can put your money in, and you just put it around your wrist or you can just kind of carry it like that. And I like it because it still looks very chic and can go with any outfit, especially with the clear container of this purse. And I love the hardware and the nude. And that nude allows me to kind of change it up and put it with any outfit that I wear. Okay, now that you see this leather blazer, I'm going to show you another blazer that you can put on. Okay, so I got this long, it's more like of a, it's a long line blazer, but I thought it was um, really nice too. So, kind of similar to the leather one, but of course this is in a different material and it's a little bit longer, but I felt like this is another way to switch it up and I, I find it very comfortable. I folded up the sleeves a little bit. I got it this from Misguided like two years ago and I've been keeping it in my closet ever since. Okay, so another jacket that I like to wear. This isn't like a thick jacket. This is just something that you can wear in the fall and just to elevate your look. I got this from Misguided and this is in the size 6. I possibly could do a size 4 as well, but it's more in a cream color and yeah. So the reason why I haven't changed yet is because I wanted just to show you guys just wearing simple pieces and how you can switch it up with the jacket or just different accessories. And I've actually worn this jacket like going to the movies or you know just like grabbing some lunch but whenever I have jackets like this I always like to get like a lint brush because for some reason the fibers always get on my shirt so I always keep a lint brush so I will always say if you are a person who's trying to elevate your outfit um, make sure you always just kind of keep a lint brush um, on the side because you don't want to look scraggly you want to always make sure that you look well put together and that you have that chic look okay so I decided to switch the top that I had and I put on this basic top that I got from H&M this is more in a tan color and I got this for $5.99 and I just thought this was super cute and I also changed my shoes and I put on these strappy heels from Fashion Nova and I also got this watch from H&M and I'm just showing you just like the little small pieces that you can put together to elevate your style and to still look chic and I just felt like these these pieces that I have on looks like a million bucks you know it seems basic but you still look good and you don't have to have all those prints on your shirt. You can just style it and you can switch them out. Now, I got this top in um, tan. I have it in white and I have it in black. And just to add a pop of color, I have like a minty color as well from fashion from forever 21 so i feel like all of these little pieces you can switch in and out just to kind of um, make your outfit and build your outfit for a revamped look and um, what i wanted to do is show you um, what i can put with this so i also um, paired it with the purse that i have from h&m and look at that doesn't that look cute this purse was probably no more than like 16 or 17 dollars 
but this is another basic that you have and they had them in black and they also had them in white and so I love this little cream taupey color and I thought that that looked cute too. If, you, if you're a person who doesn't like to put your purses on the side, you can also do it as a crossbody as well. And then you can see what it looks like with the different tops as well and how you can switch it out. And look, I can still use the same purse with these outfits and it still looks cute. Some other basic tops that I have is this basic tee that I got from Skims and they have... Um, so many different colors the comfort is amazing and they stretch really well so this is like a bodysuit so I got this in a size small but you I could have also got it in a size medium too um, I feel like the extra small would have been too much like too tight but I felt like the small was perfect and so they on Skims website they have these in um, the color black they have white garnet and um, like minty color and I can show you that as well and they also have it in like this brown color which I think is super cute too and I am loving these bodysuits like they're just so comfortable and I can wear them with anything I can also wear them with sweats and so there's stuff that are just timeless and I can just kind of keep it in the closet and bring it out anytime and look great I got this white bodysuit this one's a rib bodysuit and I got this from Abercrombie and Fitch and I feel like so many people are sleeping on Abercrombie and Fitch. They have amazing um, basics. Uh, some of their size do run a little bit big so like I got this in a small but I probably could have gotten an extra small. Um, but they have amazing basics and I like to wait till they are on sale because Abercrombie and Fitch can be a little bit pricey. Now I feel like compared to the Skims bodysuits this the torso part is a little bit longer so it seems like these are for people who do have a little bit longer torso and which is a great option to have but yeah just as an option as a white bodysuit i got this rib one and i probably most likely will wear it in the spring because it's just a teeny bit thicker than the skims one so yeah this is really super cute too just like how i was wearing the black turtleneck you could also get like black you can also get turtlenecks that are like in gray or you can have a nude color you can do white i don't do white as often only because i do wear makeup sometimes so i don't i hate ruining white t-shirts you know but the best time that i say to buy basics especially if you're trying to elevate your wardrobe is definitely in October, November, December, especially when they're having like sales going on for the holidays or the change of the season. So if you if it's going to be the end of the summertime, then you want to start getting the winter stuff. They have they have tremendous sales and that's where you can get the bulk for your stuff at one time. But if not and you kind of want to take your time, I would say every paycheck, get two items and just build like that. And that's something that I used to do. If I'm like, okay, you know, I'm trying to change my wardrobe, but how am I going to do this quickly? So that's what I do is I would take my paychecks and just build upon that just so that I can get the desired wardrobe that I like. I also wanted to talk about shoes. So with the shoes, like what I have now is these strappy heels. I always get a basic strappy heel. This is like a square strappy heel from Fashion Nova and it fits around my heel. Um, I like the comfort of things going around my heel, but I also have these black heels as well. And whenever I'm wearing like a skirt, like a midi skirt, which means it like starts right here, then it ends like at my ankle, or um, if I'm wearing like a leather skirt, I pair them with these ankle booties. And what I love about these, I got these from Simi. Simi Shoes, S-I-M-M-I. -M -M -I. And they're a little more pricey, especially with the shipping because they're coming from the UK. But they usually ship overnight or two days. So don't select like overnight because they still send it within two days just because the shipping is more. But look at that. Look at that design right there. And I love these little ankle booties because in the winter time, if you are wearing a skirt, it just covers up your ankle and makes you feel comfortable. And I love the stretch to them. Now with these semi shoes, they don't have half sizes. So like I wear a seven and a half, but I got these in a seven. And I just love the print on them. For these ones, they had um, black, they had orange, 
and they had tan so i mean when i tell you orange it was like a beautiful orange but i just wanted to kind of go with like a basic heel and they're super comfortable and they're actually well made so i will try to leave the link below so that you can see these heels and you know like i said i wear them like with my midi skirts um midi m-i-d-i and i usually pair them with like a bandeau top and a blazer and they're really all right you guys so this concludes my video for today let me know what you think about my closet revamp of thomas and basic attire let me know if you guys are trying to up your game in your closet or if you like or dislike some of the items that i have i'm gonna have more videos coming out make sure you like subscribe and comment and i'll see you guys in my next video Bye bye